Today we're going to be replacing the kidney grills on my 335i. Pretty easy task to do, so I'm going to show you how to do it. Alrighty. I'm just going to need a ratchet with a T30. A T30 is going to be used for these head bolts here. I'm just going to remove them. And then um, in the back of these grills, there are some tabs. Uh, pretty easy to take out. I'm going to try using this pick. It's my best friend for working on BMWs. Okay, this pick is going to be used to remove the tabs and eventually take the grills off. And then after that, it's easy. You just pop them right back on. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how to do that. So first you just want to remove the bolts. Just loosen them up. They come off easy. Forehead bolts. Try not to drop them. It's a pain trying to get bolts inside the engine. So, worst thing you can do is drop these bolts inside. And you're not gonna like trying to find them. So now that the uh, head bolts are all removed and the pump bumper, so it's pretty easy now. You can just you can go in and you can see the tabs inside, and you're just gonna depress the tabs. Pretty easy at that point. You can use the pick. I'm gonna be using the pick to do this. I find it easy. Um, so. That's what I'm going to be doing, as you can see, simple uh, depress up and on the top ones down, depress down and you should be able to remove them. I'm using the pick, let's get this right in here, push down on the top ones. Go we'll right along with it. Yeah. Kind of play with it a little bit. The bottom ones. Those are the ones you gotta pull up. Just push, pull up and push. Probably wanna try from the side, it's easier. Myself, so I don't break anything. I don't want to break these. Yeah. And pop right back in. So just a little bit up close here. Now we just have to get the bottom ones. And basically when you put the pick in there, you wanna pull that up on the tab uh, to remove them. Okay, you just pull, pull all three of them up and then you just, you should be able at this point, pull the grill up. I'm 
gonna pop the new one in and uh, you just want to make sure you clean this area a little bit Clean it up a little bit so it can sit right and everything I'm gonna put new, new grills on there and it's dirty so just gonna clean it up So now for the easy part, just gonna put these on and just follow the tabs. Pretty easy. They just snap on. There we go. Now just a little tip here. Uh, because these are aftermarket, you may have to do a little bit of adjust, adjustment. Where you just move these up and kind of like push them out so that they can sit in the OEM bumper uh, correctly. So the trick I did was on all these tabs, okay, to get it to sit properly, um, I used a prying tool, okay, and basically you just flip it up, all right? And you do these on all of them. That way you won't have any gaps or um, they won't, it won't be easy to come off or remove when the hood is down. I finagled it. So nice and easy. Pretty easy. Not, not easy to come off. Both of these are sitting on right. So here they are, looking pretty clean. I don't like that chrome. I don't like the chrome grills, so you know we gotta replace them. Vehicle looking nice now. Nice and black. No chrome. Please hit the like and subscribe button. And follow me, I'm gonna have some more videos coming out soon. Thank you for watching.